why you should pull for Kronk. One, her name is Kronk. You should just forget the rest of the part of the name. Her name's Kronk. Just there you go. That right there is enough reason to pull for her. Okay. If you like big booba waifu girls, pull for Kronk. She's a big booba blonde waifu girl. Like, I don't... She's got great legs. Got cool ass gear. Got a decent personality. She's even got a boob mole. Didn't even notice that before. She's got a boob mole. Right? It's cultured. Uh, she's another dishwasher character, which means you either hate her or love her simply because of that. Because for some reason, people have a real fucking hard on boner for hating on dishwasher. I don't know why, but they do. So, whatever. Um... Let's look at her skills. Increase the ship's firepower and evasion by 8%. That's good. Every 8 times the ship fires her main gun, fires a level 10 special barrage. If this ship has a large caliber main gun equipped, decrease the shot requirement to 4 and improves this barrage. It's pretty good. It's a pretty good barrage too. Tempered Prudence. Decreases this damage this ship takes from AP ammo by 8%. That's actually pretty good considering she has uh, medium armor. Uh, every four times the ship fires her secondary guns, fires a level 10 special bras that decreases the firepower of enemies hit by 5%. What? She decreases the firepower of the enemies? That's so good. When the ship equips a northern parliament gun, increase the ship's secondary gun efficiency by 45% and instead reducing AP damage taken, decrease all damage taken by 8%. What? 8% damage reduction, an increased efficiency with her secondary gun. That's crazy. Wild, strong-willed support. During a battle, when this ship's HP falls below 10%, a result of damage taken, decreases this ship's burn damage taken by 50%, and recovers 1% of her max HP every second for 10 seconds. So recovers 10% HP. That's crazy. Who would ever want that? Who would ever want her to have a heal? This makes her actually incredibly good for a mob fleet, by the way. While this ship is afloat, when a fleet this ship is not in starts a battle, if the fleet's flagship is a battleship, decrease the main gun spread of all your BBs, by two. Wow. That's crazy. Main gun spread. Obviously, nobody can figure out the quantification of how good that is, but just to let you know, it's really good. Two, 20 seconds after the battle starts, fires a level 10 special barrage that decreases the speed of enemies hit by 40% for five seconds. Wow, that's so good. And I'm not even like, I'm being kind of sarcastic, but the reason I'm being sarcastic is because for some pe reason, people have it in their head that Kronk is bad. And I don't know why. I don't know where this thought process came from. I don't know why suddenly everybody's like, Kronk is bad. You don't need to pull for her. You don't need all this. You don't need to pull for any ship in this game. She's not bad. She's very, very good. Very, very good. Very good for your su for supporting your battleship fleets from another fleet, basically, being a good mob ship frontline ship she self heals she has a barrage she has two barrages actually she has a uh, increased efficiency with her secondary which also again makes her really good for mob fleet absolutely ridiculous absolutely ridiculous that people think this character is bad so i mean just look at my chat right Krog is bad because Aegir is amazing, right? Like, these are sentiments that people actually... My chat's not saying this. These are sentiments that people actually believe and feel and think. And it's crazy. Absolutely insane. So, yeah. There you go.